What is IgA? IgA stands for immunoglobulin type A. There are a number of other immunoglobulins. IgA is an antibody whose task is to destroy and remove harmful parasites and particles from the body. This means that IgA has the task of removing particles that the immune system deems harmful. When those particles are not harmful, such as pollen, but the immune system considers them harmful, then we have a situation known as allergy. In a situation where pollen is deemed harmful, the immune system causes the production of a larger than normal amount of IgA. Hence, the quantity of IgA in the blood is an indication of whether there is an allergic reaction or not. Remember that IgE by itself is not harmful, nor it is a disease. All people and mammals have IgE. There is a scale devised to give an indication of the quantity of IgE in the blood. 100 is considered normal. The higher the value of IgE in the blood, the more severe the allergy is. My IgE level reached 513 in the year 2009 and started to gradually drop after that. At the same time, I felt gradual improvement in my allergy illness. This is my maximum reached IgE level of 513 in 2009. You can see here the level of IgA dropped to 461 in 2010 and 334 in 2012. At the time of making this video, my IgA was 229. While my IgA was high enough to give me severe trouble, other people have IgE levels that run into thousands. This is called hyper-IgE levels.